So right now at six, we're talking trash and the latest Memphis, uh, the latest Memphis by Memphis to tackle illegal dumping. For months, ABC 24 provided solutions and results after highlighting concerns from you of all the trash tossed and piled up all over town. City Council recently approved a new task force to help in the fight against illegal dumping, but some of the trenches aren't sure it goes far enough. Brad Broders is live at one illegal dumping site he's found in Orange Mound. Brad. Well, Richard, this illegal dumping site and so many others across the city of Memphis, a far cry from recent decades where the key organization Keep America Beautiful gave the Bluff City eight national awards between 1980 and 2002. Well, Memphis City Council members and neighborhood advocates both agree that this cleanup is so important. They're also differing on their approach. I live in Whitehaven, but I advocate all over Memphis. It's a mess out here. That's why spotting and cleaning up illegal dumping is such a passion for Dr. Yvonne Nelson, who helps lead the beautification nonprofit, My Zip. Don't ask what the community can do for you. Do for your community. Don't be silent. Still, Dr. Nelson is skeptical about the impact of a newly formed blight and illegal dumping task force approved Tuesday by the Memphis City Council. You cannot be behind a desk and not come out and be active in what's going on. It's not going to be effective. Supporters of the task force said it will create new collaboration and resolve among different city agencies to clean up more illegal dumping sites quicker. My desire is to see that the task force will inform everything that's done, bring everyone together, um, you know, look at the trends, the data, analyze what's, what we need to do, look at for best practices. The task force's input will also complement another newly formed 17 member team, along with new equipment focused exclusively on illegal dumping response and cleanup. We want to really move the needle in this uh, situation because if not, it's, it's gotten out of hand and it'll continue to get worse. Dr. Nelson hopes task force members go out on illegal dumping cleanups to see the challenges firsthand. She also concedes it will take a different mindset among Memphians to take more pride of their blocks and the Bluff City as a whole. If you teach the little one, don't throw your paper down. They're going to tell their parents, you shouldn't throw that out the window. Now, once its members are assigned, the Illegal Dumping Task Force will provide monthly updates to the Memphis City Council. The City of Memphis also set up 100 covert cameras across the city to catch illegal dumpers in the act, and that ID can be used to pursue criminal charges. Now, also, you, if you do see illegal dumping like this one in Orange Mound, you're asked to call 311. Live in Orange Mound, I'm Brad Broders.